Sí. Listo. What is going on with Gus and Mike? Is this Jesse and the gang? It was. Oh, hell no. Is he even alive? And what about Mike? Yeah, what about the other guy? Well, his name is Mike. Oh, of course, yeah. I get that. But still, well, Gus is their priority. Have you heard from anyone? So, he kinda knows what's going on. Pinkman is gone. Well, not fully. I quit. Well, then, just do what you gotta do for now. My brother in law, he keeps talking about driving out to the factory. Wouldn't now be a good opportunity? Can you just run it up the chain of command then? Tell them we will be arriving soon. Anything suspicious? Oh, we're here. The next three moves is sitting here and waiting. What a boring job. No, he just wants to get the hell out of here. He knows how risky this is. And dangerous. In Romans about some big play down south. Walter's like, what the hell? How am I supposed to interpret that? So he looks worried. I don't know, Hank. Maybe you shouldn't know. Walter, do you have a good story for this? I don't want to talk about it. To you or to anyone else. It's as simple as that. Will Hank accept that? He kind of has to. Oh. So, they've kind of taken care of him. Hey, it uh, looks that way. Yo, you think he needs more blood? In case. Jesse's like, how are you so prepared? He thought of There's no point in asking even. Always prepared. Oh! Hey there, big boss. It's time to go. What about Mike? Yeah. I'll send for him. Jesse's like, no, I'm staying with him. You did well down here. You also proved the point. What do you mean? What did I, I do you exactly? Can run the lab by yourself now. Well, this again, Gus. You gotta understand. Let Mr. White go. Oh. Pay him off or fire him. Yeah, just don't kill him. You know that won't work. Then you got a problem. Yeah, because I'm still alive and I'm here. Gus is ruthless. But you gotta be. This ain't your normal business. Okay, hey, let's fight. Hey, come on in. Look at your house. What is this? I can't take your money. Oh, really? I don't know. It feels wrong. What? I'm not judging you or Walt. I'm just saying I, I feel uncomfortable with it. Then what are you gonna do? I pay the IRS. Then what? Then you don't owe them. I Okay, but I still owe the bank, Skylar. All right. I see your point. Just because it's not enough? No, no. Don't twist my words. This isn't about amounts. Maybe it this is. It's about me doing the right thing. Ted, you're being Ted, sneaky here. Blackmailing me? What? No, blackmailing? Maybe he is. She is not stupid. Come on, Ted. I noticed that uh, this is for less than what I gave you, by the way. This dude is just hopeless. What do we do with him? Another problem. Skylar. Same amount. Only this time made payable. What happened to Make us? it payable to the Internal Revenue Service. I can't. You have to. Is that gonna become a real problem? Who are you calling? Saul? Saul Goodman, please. Of course. Hello, Hector. Hey! I'm back. This should be fun. I'm going to tell you all about Mexico and how it went. You know, I had a fantastic trip from Don Eladio to you. You recognize it? All dead. Too bad you weren't there. Maybe you could have done something. And this is sadistic. This young man. Do you remember him? Jesse's like, Gus, why did you take me here? I believe you have met him. What is the point of this? Are you just messing with him? Now, the Salamanca name dies with you. Yikes. Even Jesse's uncomfortable. Well, of course he'd be. Any more news on that thing in Mexico? Nah, same old, same old. Is that so? Uh, Pretty much. No, listen, uh, take it right of the street here, right? Right? But, uh, going to the chicken farm, that's straight ahead. Hank, where are we going now? Yeah, there's this, uh... Oh, hell no. Hell to the no. Turns out, it's the same company that owns uh, Frank's chicken joints. And we don't have an opportunity to warn them. No, it just, it just sounds kind of thin. Walter, the more you speak, the more suspicious 
things look. Let's go along with it. Maybe that's the smart thing to do right now. What? What are you doing? You just missed it. So sorry. It looked like a dirt road. I, I thought you meant further up. What is about to happen here? What? Well, I get what you're doing, but that's a bit risky. Way in here, Uncle Hank. Hey, it's free food. <clears throat> free food <laughs> Poor Hank. Hank. Free drinks even better. Walter's going to kill him somehow by accident. Mr. Magoo, yeah, sure. Hey, watch out! Don't run into any walls or anything. <laughs> this is too funny. Sorry about all this. <laughs> Sorry about yeah, this. He just came out of nowhere. Yeah, <laughs> no, I don't think so. I saw him coming a mile away. Hey, are you blind or what? Yeah, I broke down. I uh, ordered me a gimp mobile. Well, is that good? Isn't this even worse? Sorry. Car wash business. Car wash business. Yeah, right. The way I see it, we're good to go. That is, if this is still how you want to handle it. What exactly is the plan? Like want to tell us? I don't want anyone hurt. All I want is for him to write a check. Don't tell me that this is going to go wrong as well. You don't want anyone to go get hurt? We know what that means. Someone is going to get hurt. Can I help you? Yeah. Oh, Thanks. Bill is back with Big Boy. Fuel. You happy? Reasonably. Reasonably. Oh, unhappy. This little motherfucker not doing what he's told. Okay, Ted must be confused and a little bit scared, probably. Skylar's got a white sent you. Doesn't matter who sent. Oh my God. I don't know about this. Sit down and write. There you go. Just do it, man. You're making me panic over here. Oh, 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 oh! How clumsy can you be? I hope he's not dead. Is that a good sign? I don't know. What is going on? What do you mean? Okay, Walter's gonna get paranoid again. I love this. This is it. This is life. This is what I want for Jesse. You weren't supposed to return. What do you want? I'm busy. Yeah, can't you see? Well, last time we talked, we almost killed each other. Okay, okay. Let's behave. Let's behave, please, guys. He's going to use you to replace Walter. Jesse still has your back. You need me anymore. You can't be sure of that, of course. This time I asked for your help. He said, I hope you end up buried in a barrel. He, he didn't forget that. <laughs> Walter might do his own thing now. Things will just escalate. Hey, hey. No freaking way. What the hell is happening? You are about to kill him. Nah, this is unbelievable. Yes, he's here. It's happening. Surely, no, I don't believe it. You are done. Nope, I'm not. Fired. What does that mean? Okay. Stay away from Pinkman. Okay. Do not go near him. Okay. Or else you'll do what? Kill you, probably. You can't kill me. Because Jesse wouldn't cook for you if you did. Walter is sharp. But you should probably not tempt him, right? Are you sure about that? Is the matter of your brother in law. Oh yeah, about he Hank. Is a problem you promised to resolve. Well, I don't know what I can do. Don't freaking if touch him. If you try him. to interfere, this becomes a much simpler matter. I will kill your wife. Kill my wife? Oh, this is war. I will kill your infant daughter. Should you be saying that to Walter? Gus, are you out of your mind? Well, he kinda is. I feel like Walter needed to hear this, but not for the reasons you might think. I don't think he will forgive Gus for this, for saying that. Yo, so much going on right now. Checks in the mail, at least. Oh, hello, Mrs. White. Wait, the good what news the hell happened? The has been paid off. The bad news is... Hey, hey, what happened to Ted? Hey! Whoa, 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 slow down! What the... Oh. Uh, how did you hear? What? Hear, hear what? As I said, so much going on. Or this this person that you said could could disappear me, give me a whole new life. Yeah, it has to happen now. Gus is gonna murder my whole family. Well, yeah, I get Walter right now. He is freaking out. He's like, we gotta get away from here. Can't say it's been a pleasure. I need you to do one more thing for me. 
And what is that? Call the DEA, and you need to tell them that Gus has a hit out on Hank. This is just too much. Can we just relax for a moment? Easy for me to say, right? I'll say it's the cartel. They're coming back to finish the job that they botched. You say whatever you That's good. You just give me I like that. Walter is a broken man. Yeah, where is the rest? This guy has been playing around, you know. But you don't know about that. Dude, guys, I need some popcorn. Are you gonna tell him or what? I gave it to Ted. <laughs> I just wanna laugh. I <laughs> he's like what? <laughs> How about we all hide here? <laughs> he has gone mad. <laughs> How about we all leave? Hank you, what a complete mess. Sky, come on, you gotta stay strong. Everyone is losing it. He has calmed down? Is rational and logical Walter back? I honestly don't know. Wow, this episode was hectic. They do an amazing job at making us feel the way the characters feel. I'm stressed out, just like Walter. And everyone else pretty much. Walter wants to get the hell out with his whole family. Or he has to. But I don't think it's gonna happen. That last scene with him calming down reinforced that feeling for me. He's about to come up with something. Probably something outrageous. I wouldn't even be surprised if this means war. Between Walter and Gus of course. And you know what I think? Jesse will be the deciding factor in all of this somehow. Gus seems pretty confident that he has Jesse's loyalty. I think he might be miscalculating. Even though things are bad between Walter and Jesse, when it comes down to it, if Jesse has to decide between Walter and Gus, I think he's gonna pick Walter's side. I mean, they go way back. I might be completely wrong about this though. We might not even get to that point. Then, we have the whole Ted situation. What the hell happened to my man? No one was supposed to get hurt, but I was right. Things never go according to plan, especially when you're dealing with a wild card, which Ted is or was, I don't know anymore. I feel like this episode has solidified Gus as a villain. I gotta be honest, he was in the grey zone for me, but in this episode we got it directly from him. He is prepared to eradicate Walter. What he said to Walter is some serious stuff. That was Gus's last warning to Walter, and Walter is about to screw it up, maybe even intentionally. Anyway guys, that's it for this one. Thank you so much for watching. If you don't know what to watch next, here's a video I'd recommend. And if you haven't already, please subscribe, I'd much appreciate it. Thank you.